Hi Floppy Catters, this is the Red Rocket Litter Twister Classic. And this is the Purr Litter Twister. They both operate very similarly, that there's a twisting mechanism on the lid. And I'm gonna show you how it works on the inside. So let's say that this is a pea clump and you have just scooped the litter box, you put the pea clump or the poop there. Then you close the litter twister, twist this. You hear the pea and poop clump drop. So in other words, you're never exposed to the smell at all because the bag is always closed when the lid is up. It only opens when the lid is down. There seem to be kind of two different styles that they come in. Uh, and one has this little like notch there. So this one came with the notch one. So I'm gonna go ahead and use that for this demonstration. But either one of them will work. Um, I found out that it's best to kind of bend these ahead of time. It makes it a little easier for it to function once you get it in. All right, so there's a red hook here and then there's a white hook there. So you'll notice on the bag that there's a red side and then just a plain white side. So you wanna take the red and align it with the red hook. And then you wanna take the white one and put it on the wet hook. Once that's done, you can bring this together. And this is also similar to how you will take it out. This is a level that you want to install it on. I mistakenly, when I first started going on this, I mistakenly put it on this level, not realizing. So it's this level that you put it on. You align the big hole with the big peg. And then this kind of wraps around like a circle. It takes a little bit of muscle strength to get these on the peg or finger strength that I don't have and I'm scared to break my nails. All right, then you put this level down and then that secures the bag. Now, the one thing about these litter twister devices is that the bag always starts closed and that's why there's that little red sticker there. It wants you to turn it 360 degrees so that the bag is always closed. To remove the bag, you gotta access where these hook onto the little pegs. You're going to pick all of those up and then you can switch it together however you want. This one, there we go. Want that little notch to put these bag tags on. And the bag's already twisted because that's how it operates. It stays in a twisted motion anyway. So you can take that red one, wrap it around, wrap it up or however, and then it's ready to take to the trash. Now, another way, if you didn't want to like, you know, try to gather all the tabs at this level, since the bag's already twisted, you can just shove it down in there and pick it up this way and then you'll have a lot more space oh and then it untwisted um a lot more space to get it all twisted together again if you want thank you so much for watching our quick demo video of the per litter twister as well as the litter twister classic and we'll see you next time